Lot 15. Seem like there's any clear advantage to being at the net, being in the backcourt right now. I think at this stage it's just a a real patience game, and who's going to be able to battle it out and make one less error. I yep. think all the players are just so beat and just battling through it. There we see some of those overheads trying to bait people into driving. Just a little bit softer, a little bit shorter. Trying to get them to take a bit of a risk. There's a look. Oh, another leg cord. Lock. That's the first ball Randy Lawford's played in a while. Tempo picking up at the net there for Lewis and Will Lawford. Just letting Edwin Lewis do all the work. Hammer away to the Crick corner. Crick is just a warrior right now, just battling it out. Yep. Every ball back, every ball up. There's a look. to be the one to miss. at it. This quintessential paddle right here. Neither player has has the feet or the real big get to take a massive risk. So they're just keeping it going. Extremely disciplined play from both teams. And they're playing to stay on the Christmas card, don't forget that Brad. Funny thing is, yeah, we're definitely up over 100 balls, and they're not even going for anything on the overhead. They're just making sure not to hit it to a specific place. It's just a question of who's going to break. This is the kind of stubbornness that only br two brothers playing against each other can have. <laughs> that is the only, only time you could really see this. I love the it. The only possibility, the mental. <laughs> the only thing that could push it to the limits this far. Oh, I love it. Here. 
These four warriors are just battling it out for a place in tomorrow's battle against Tyler Frazier and Adam Morgan, which is taking place at 9 a.m. Oh my word. This is extreme discipline. It's extreme something. <laughs> it's definitely the extreme. I mean, there's no question they're just going to keep doing one than the other. He's pushing it to his brother's forehead. Look at this. I'd like to see them do this for another 60 balls because every other ball was at Crick for about, you know, every ball was at Crick for a good first 70 balls at that point, right? Yeah. And now they switch it off. He's going to push it to his brother's forehand. And <laughs> there we go. And now Will Lofgren goes into his brother's forehand. Oh, my word. All right, what do you think is going to happen next, Mark Innes? <laughs> oh, wait, a look. Wait. No. Oh, I saw a better lob. That was actually, they had somebody off the net for a half a second. I just hope there's no drones flying up there like we saw in Cincinnati when the point. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Rob Becker stop and play in the middle of a 100 ball point. What's the drone doing up there? You've got to feel like whoever wins this point has the has the advantage in the match. This, uh, is, this is laying it all out right here. Yeah, you kind of do. Like whoever breaks here is broken, right? Yep. There's just so much emotion and will going into this. Have you ever played a point like this? I'm afraid I have. Yeah, killer. How many it's balls? Still, do you it's think still it still scars me to these days. I lost it. But no, when you you know, for these players out there, when you're in the zone, you know, it it doesn't even feel like it's as long as it is for the for the viewers at home. They're in the zone. They know what they're doing. They're they're leaving it all out there to get the victory. And this is just what they're willing to do. So I guess the ends justify the means. Yep. <laughs> there we go. point if we can get a little I must count him out for now. This is gonna be a 300 ball point. Nice dig there for Nathan Crank. If you miss it now it's this is a killer point. Like you said this could be the break. Great lob. Good luck. Do they even want to change it up like where they hit a hard overhead and see what happens? Hard overhead I bail. I think when they're this far in, they're just like, <laughs> nope. It's now. It's just a. It's we're gonna do this. You're gonna do that. Let's see who's gonna miss. And I think when when you are into this this rhythm, you, it's actually very hard to change it up, right? You you don't have the comp for your. In your ability to, it's it's you sort of lose it when you get to this stage. Well, I got a text from Brian Heil saying he's still tuned in here, and he didn't think this third set was going to be a battle. Uh, he might change his tune now, just watching this single point. That's it. This this single point's almost like a third set. Could be. I think actually what I, I have heard our producer just say in my ear here, Mark, is that people are now leaving Louisville to come watch the end of this match. They feel they'll get here to Detroit by the time this Absolutely. point is over. I, I, they, I think we'll there's still plenty be of time. There's, still, there's plenty of time. They might be coming to a world record here if there is one, which I have no idea what it would be. But we definitely we, need a shot clock. We got to have a, a time marker as to when this point started and get our producer on that. If not, we'll have to go to the replay afterwards and just do the uh, do the shot clock because um, I'm just even talking time now, not even number of hits. <laughs> Our producer says we're going to have a replay between 7 and 9 tomorrow. Now you can tune into this one point. 
It does remind me of one match, which was really funny. We were talking about back in the day, if you ever played a grind or something, Mark. And people still always had different styles. And I remember I was, you know, playing. Oh. You know, Muller, top team at the time. You know, they were number one in the country. And you know, we were just, we had a great match going. And we played one point. And you know, next to us was uh, another match. And, uh, I think they played five games. You know, they played five games. We played one point. Did you win the point? We did. Nice. That's it. It's for the glory at this stage. You're going to remember this forever. And it's on live streaming. <laughs> Which is good and bad. I mean, this is amazing at this point. I got to just... I'm, I'm hunkered down. Oh. At this stage, you can't stop watching. No. He's going to mix it up with a heavy roller. Oh, hard overheads now. Hard overheads. Okay. Of course, that's coming off. Nope. Hard overheads down. Oh, Rich is letting it get to the end. It's oh. a stage. <laughs> and now we it's go this way. That's Yes. We'll see if they're going to do anything with these overheads. Oh, my God. Slide there. Oh, the mental right. fortitude right now is just ridiculous. Now, now imagine if Lewis puts in one of those little flippers that goes off the top of the net again, or a net ball. Oh, oh! <laughs> that was just a. <laughs>